In this video, I'm going to show you how to clean up your location targeting, some things to look for, some different settings to be aware of, to make sure you're targeting people in the right location and only in the right location. So to, uh, to start this, we're going to go into the campaign and we're going to go into settings. And then this is where we can look at our locations and make changes. So for starters, I want you to look at all of the targeted locations in your campaign. Uh, this particular campaign that I found uh, is targeting Spain as a country, which I'm pretty certain is an error since this is a local business in Ohio. So this you would want to remove. I'm assuming that happened because whoever set this up excluded all of these different countries. My guess is they wanted to exclude Spain, but actually added it to the targeting instead. So first step, just look at the locations you're targeting. Make sure there aren't any mistakes there. Uh, sometimes I see people targeting a, a city. Maybe there is a, a city in a different state with the same name, and you're accidentally targeting that city instead. One thing you can do to get a more visual representation of this is go to the advanced search. And then it'll show you your targeting on a map. So we can see pretty clearly here, Spain is blue and it shouldn't be. We really should only see the blue targeting in the little location that we wanna target. Uh, same thing for if you're just looking across the United States and you notice a blue dot somewhere that you're not intending to target, uh, maybe you added the wrong city or the wrong zip code by mistake. So first step here would be to get rid of Spain, of course. Um, so as, as far as these excluded locations, um, I'm not worried about that. It doesn't hurt anything, but it, it's really not necessary. So one thing that we wanna look at are these advanced location options down here when we pull down this dropdown. So this account is set up for the default option of people in, or who show interest in your targeted locations. This opens up your targeting to people all over the world who aren't in your location, but maybe for some reason Google feels they are interested in the location. Let me show you what this actually looks like. So um, if we go to locations over here, and then we can look at the user location report this is going to show us uh, all the traffic that we're getting from places outside of the targeted location. Now, if I look at a longer time frame here, we can see a, a fair amount of traffic has come not just from Spain, which was being targeted, but from other countries as well. If we look just in the United States, we can see a good amount of traffic has come from states outside of Ohio. You could even uh, look more closely here within Ohio, and you can see which cities you are getting traffic from. But what this tells us is Google sending traffic to the campaign outside of the areas we're targeting, and it's because of this setting here. We are allowing that to happen. To prevent that, what we need to do is change the target setting to people in or regularly in your targeted locations. This is only gonna then show our ad to people who live in our target location or maybe they work in the targeted location and they, they commute there from someone else or from somewhere else. Um, it could still show our ad to those people when they're not in the location we're targeting but it's people who spend a lot of time in the targeted location, and that's gonna prevent all this traffic from outside uh, areas. So, the, uh, so that's, that's what you can do to, uh, to clean up a lot of this. Also, while you're in here, just, just consider the locations that you are targeting best way is to just look at a map, okay? 
zoom in on the locations you're trying to target. Maybe you're targeting uh, not specific zip codes like, like this account is. Maybe you're targeting a, a city or a metro area or a radius. And you can think about maybe within that city, there are some zip codes where you don't particularly want to get traffic from. Or maybe you're targeting a, a bigger radius and uh, perhaps that's cutting into a, a different state and you want traffic from your particular state, but you don't want traffic from that other state. You could still target that radius and then just exclude the surrounding states that you don't want traffic from. So while you're in here, just think hard about where your target customer is and where your target customer isn't. It's not so important to be excluding all these extra countries. What is important is excluding locations that are really close to your target, to the tar your target location, but are not necessarily locations where you want to be getting customers from. Those are the more important locations to exclude. So hopefully this video helped a lot with your location targeting and with with cleaning some of this up and making sure you're only getting traffic from where you want to be getting traffic from. My name is Kyle Sellerud and I'll see you in the next video.